Welcome to the Scratch tutorial. This time we will try to make a short story where different characters are actually talking to each other. So let's get started. The first thing I want to do is to remove the cat and replace it with something more interesting. Let's say uh, we'll pick a character from here. Uh, maybe we want it to be people. And then maybe we want it to be a wizard boy. And another one which is a wizard girl like that and I will just quickly go into her costume and switch her around so that she's actually facing the boy and there we go now for this story I'd want them to say some different things to each other so I'll go directly into the script of the wizard boy and go into the looks because here we have the possibility to save something. So I'll pick out this say thing. And I also want it to happen once I've clicked the green flag. So I'll add a green flag on top of that. And then I will say hello for two seconds. And we'll try that. So we can see that the wizard boy is now saying hello for two seconds. Now I want the wizard girl to, to answer to that. And the way I'll do that is to go into events and then I will add a broadcast message below that because this is a message that will be broadcasted to all the other objects inside of the story so I'll go here and add a new message and I will call it boy1 now I will go to the wizard girl and on her side I will instead uh, pick the block that is for when I receive boy1 and then I will go into looks for her and actually make her say something such as hi how are you then I'd like her to send a message in turn back to the boy and this message I will call it girl Over at the wizard boy, I will go to control and I will, uh, I mean events, and then I will take the receive message, girl1, and go into looks again, and then I'll pick out another speech, uh, say, I'm fine, let's go to the moon and I will once again send out a another broadcast and this time I will call it boy 2 and I'll go back to the girl and I will make her receive the boy 2 and then I'll make her think rather than say nice and then I will send another message this time I will call it go to moon and now I want them to actually switch the places that they are in during this story so I'll go to the stage and I'll go to the backdrops and I'll add a backdrop one for when they're starting let's say this field for instance and then I'll not add yet another picture and I'll look into the space theme and I'll pick the moon and then I'll remove this white background that is in the beginning and we can try this story hello hi how are you I'm fine let's go to the moon nice and at this point I want the, the actual backdrop to receive the message go to moon and I then want to go into looks and actually switch the backdrop to moon now there's one thing that's a little bit weird here and that is when we restart the story like if we start the story and we go to the end of it you'll notice that they will in fact go to the moon but when I start it again, they will start on the moon, which is not right. 
And we can fix this by adding a, when I click the green flag event, and then make sure that when that is done, it will actually switch the backdrop to whatever backdrop we want to start with, the baseball field in this case. And now when I start it again, it will be the right field in the beginning of the story. So that's how you can create a simple story in Scratch.